uh, New York City in your area. But uh, Jabari Bresport, who's a, a from what I understand, he's a great. Um, I think he's in the assembly in New York. Like he ran as a Green Party, but then he became a DSA member. But he put out this tweet. According to a study by this group, rents in Bed Stuy are up 10% since last year. They're up 22% in Fort Greene and Clinton Hill, and a whopping 48% in Prospect Heights, Brooklyn. Uh, good cause for eviction would limit rental increases. So I'm just curious, uh, Izzy, have you seen any of these type of increases? I know you're in the well, I don't want to say it unless you want to say it, but go ahead. No, yeah, I've, told, I've said I'm in the Bronx. Um, I mm -hmm. haven't heard specifically. I know that costs are going up across the board. I'll be honest. I mean, I have I have a bit of a love-hate thing with Brooklyn right now. I mean, growing up, you know, it was a love, but right now with the way it's been so gentrified, if this is mostly hitting gentrifiers, I, oh, well. Like, that's kind of how I feel. <laughs> like, oh, well. If it's hitting, you know, the people who are still, you know, trying to stick it out there, the you know, born and raised there, then I, I feel mm. for those people. But I, I can't say I, for sure. A lot of those neighborhoods do look like very gentrified neighborhoods, though. Yeah. Armani, do you know in, in your neighborhood, like, have you seen any type of super high raise in rents or anything like that going on? Uh, definitely not. So not in my neighborhood where I live, but definitely in the district, for sure. Okay. Like in um, in Newark and Jersey City, for sure. Um, and that's it's a huge issue. Like housing stability in this area is a huge issue, both when it comes to home ownership and foreclosure and when it comes to uh, rent, because rents are because basically what happens is that kind of stuff happens in New York. And then people try to flee to Jersey to find cheaper prices. And then the developers jack their prices up here. So it's just like people try and move more and more and more south. And as they do, developers just get greedier and greedier and just increase, increase, increase rents. Um, so, you know, it's definitely happening here. It's happening in pretty much any larger city, um, around the nation for sure. And it's and one crazy of the rough because, parts too is that, oh, go, go ahead. ahead, Izzy. Oh, I was just go gonna ahead. say that, um, you know, not, it's not just the people that have the means to move that are moving out, you know, further away from the city. It's also the mm -hmm. people that have no choice because they're getting forced out by some of the prices we just saw. Mm -hmm. And they have to move further away from the city because it's the only thing that they can even try to afford. And we're affecting those people too in places like Newark and all that. So yeah, it's, yeah. it's, it's rough all the way across the board. That's what they did in Washington Heights. They exactly. went and they went and like triple everyone uh, rent, mm -hmm. and then Washington Heights in the next two or three years is going to be all developers. Oh, you know. Oh, America. yo! When was the last time you've been? It's already a little late. Well, they, they, I don't know. I, already... I, I I stay away from New York. Yeah, it's, it's been forever, thing, man. Like the place where well, I used to live, but my family still lives in, in that apartment. Um, I know it was gone. I mean, it has to, it gotta be 15 years ago, probably. When I first saw Starbucks, mm -hmm. when I first saw Starbucks, I'm like, okay, this is the beginning of the end. <laughs> and, I, and 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 true to form, it, it it is, man. Like you can't even like most of the people that live in the building. Sorry to say, they like what what are they called? Is it yuppies or whatever? Mm -hmm. Like young, married, whatever, whatever. Yeah, the, and it's like that. The rent's been going up. They're dying to kick people out, including my family, because mm -hmm. they'll automatically jack up the rent. They could only increase it a certain percentage every year. Yeah. Um, but mm. if they could get them out and get new people in, they could jump in from a much larger rent from the get-go. Yeah. So they like it's a hassle to get them to fix anything because they want to make it hard so you can move out and then they could really fix it and jack up the prices. Yep. And one of the things, like, so this neighborhood that I, that I actually live in, there are high rises going up, but there are people coming to these homes all the time and asking people to sell um, their homes. 